how's everybody doing thanks for joining me and welcome back so today i am collabing with two lovely ladies um the whole collab is putting on a full face of makeup without using a single brush like any makeup brushes so if you guys would like to see the video and see how i do my full face of makeup without using any brushes then stay tuned So I was approached by Amy Miranda, which if a lot of you guys don't know who Amy Miranda is, um, she is a lovely lady here on YouTube. I have learned quite a bit from her. She has shared some wonderful tips and tricks. Um, she's really great at telling you about makeup brushes. Um, but she came to Marlene. Is it Marlene or Marlene? And I, I'm trying to think because I just recently um, have been getting to know Marlene. Um, her channel is called Marlene Fab and Glam Over 50, I believe. Wonderful lady. I've really been enjoying chatting to her and she's a school teacher. But you know teachers, I mean, hats off to them. They're the ones that help educate, like push and help educate our kids. So she came, approached both of us this whole without uh, makeup brushes. And I thought, yeah, sure. You know, I mean, I always like a challenge. Their links, of course, will be down below, both of them. So please go and check those two out and show them some love, so subscribe and everything. All right, let's get started. So this video is not long. I might have to edit, 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 edit. <laughs> Here we go. And I have water, guys. I swear. It's water. It's water. Very better help parch my I'm parched a little bit so anyway um let's get started I might have to edit is what I was gonna say for some stuff okay so foundation I'm gonna use is my hydro fluid from pure cosmetics I don't mind putting on <clears throat> foundation using fingers I know some people are like a little eh with that or a little creeped from that I'm I'm not I wash my hands you know and stuff so if you're gonna do something like this then um, yeah, just use your beauty blender sponge thingy. <laughs> My Fit Me Concealer, I'm going to use that. Now for a bronzy kind of thing or contouring, I'm going to use my uh, Pure Cameo uh, contour stick on the one side it's uh, contouring and then the other side is like highlighting or lighting or whatever so I'm gonna use that with the little spongy thing it comes with I'm gonna go ahead and highlight in certain areas that I would highlight which so I'm using the other side so for my eyes I brought some Mally eyeshadow sticks that I love love her shadow sticks and the two shades I'm going to use I love the one it's called purple rain I don't know if you can get any of these anymore maybe you can look on QVC and on her site and everything. Uh, the other one is called Sunlight. So I'm going to do Purple Rain first. We're going to work it in a crease area. They're like these really cute little, you know, eye pencil things. I'm going to use also the Jane, is it Aridel? Um, Jane Aradell, it's like a brow pencil, like one side's more white, one side has more of a pinky kind of a tone. I think I'm going to use the white side, and I'm going to do that right above the brow area. Okay, and the next shade I'm using for Mally is Sunlight. I figured that will brighten the eyelids. Yeah, I did wipe. I wanted to make sure I wiped off my fingers. And then I'm going to put my 
eyeliner on, which my all famous L'Oreal Lunier Intense. Then I'm going to go ahead and use my favorite. Uh, I use this one, the Rimmel Scandal Eyes in black. I use this a lot for my tight when tight lining and stuff. I put a little more purple rain. Just a little bit more. Just a little purple rain here to kind of make it have a little depth. Okay, here's one of Melly's uh, Ever Starlight. This is the purple red. I've done this several times on my eyes. This is the purple red. Love these eyeliners. These are some of my favorite eyeliners from her. I'm going to use <clears throat> Melly's uh, More is More mascara. This is her new mascara that she has out. It's kind of probably going to be a little bit hard to see, but it's called the More is More. It's in a black tube. Not sure if you can get it in Ulta yet, but you can order on QVC. I figured I might do, because I don't get to use them a lot, is my ColourPop blush that I have here. This one's in Jellyfish. I don't know if this one still exists. I haven't been on the ColourPop site for a while, but this is their uh, cream, cream blushes. So the uh, highlight I'm going to use is Monster. It's this really pretty duo chromey looking color. That's why I, why I liked it because it had like a purple tone to it. I'm just going to do it at the highest point of my cheeks, obviously, and then work up and through. I was going to put my mascara on the bottom. I was going to put some purple rain on the bottom area, but nah. I think I'm just going to skip that because I don't want it to look too crazy. As I'm using my Tarte Architect, Architect, my Architect. Can't say that. Get a drink there. I'm going to go ahead and put in on my Makeup Forever. Uh, lip pencil in natural. This is one of my favorite lip pencils. I was debating on what color to use, but I think I'm just going to use um, this little Makeup Forever lipstick I got for my birthday thing or whatever. I'm not even sure what color it is because I can't read the bottom. Usually they're by numbers anyway. Looks like 6N, but that's what I'm going to put on. Seems to match the lip liner pretty well. And then I'm going to use my Hydrating Primer 12 Hour Mist. Um, this is a primer you could put on before your makeup. I use it after. I don't really, I haven't used it. Maybe I should try, but. And that's how I'm going to set my makeup. Yeah, that's the look I did 
just using um, this is the look I did with not using any makeup brushes and so yeah if you're in a little pinch and you don't have any tools like I said your foundation and stuff if you have a beauty blender obviously if you don't have that use your fingers and unless you are someone's bothered with that I'm not so okay make sure you go ahead and check the other two beauties down below their links will be there and um, go ahead and click and subscribe and show them some love if you guys like this video please give it a thumbs up that would help me out so much and I appreciate that very much if you are not subscribed to my channel I would love to have you guys you can join me each week and you can go ahead and click the subscribe button that is down below totally free if you're new to the YouTube world and you don't know that it is free and as always beauties please remember to just be yourself love yourself and let the real beauty shine through so until the next time you guys all take care I will see you then bye love you guys bye